Randy's brilliant. The guy's a perfectionist, but his methods are a bit unorthodox. He's insane. Our competitors would die to have Randy. I don't think the guy sleeps. He's batshit crazy. I'm Randy. What makes the reactor stove the greatest on Earth? Other than the fact that I designed it? Superior performance in real world conditions. It can boil one and a half liters of water faster than it takes this backwards yokel to zip up his pants. In my secret laboratory deep under the Saskatchewan crust, I designed the reactor to be the ultimate all conditioned stove system. I tested it thoroughly in the lab and out in the field. At our factory in Seattle, we test every unit before it ships and goes to market. I take it one step further. Pure heaven. Get that toast to do a nice sheen. Get the squiggles. The squ squiggles. Wipe it off and do it again. Squiggles. Yeah. Good morning. Hey, Randy. I want to come by and let you know that you're doing a great job on the cycle tester here. Keep up the good work. It's really appreciated. Thanks. You're welcome. Automated testing is OK. I mean, it's good enough for Stephanie over here. My methods, a bit more rigorous. Intern. Only 34,942 more revolutions. Get to work. Don't understand the difference between an open flame and primary air combustion? The reactor is 100% primary air combustion, which allows for an integrated heat exchanger to completely enclose the burner. In the reactor, the heat exchanger captures the radiant energy and the convection of the hot gases. Couple that with an internal pressure regulator and you've got yourself an efficient stove at low temperatures and low fuel levels. The reactor is twice as fast as our nearest competitor in boiling water and an eight mile per hour breeze. React to that. Mm. Too much mustard. Too much mustard. I can't do this anymore. <laughs>